Hi, this is Dr. Don Bonner at uh, Personalized Wellness. Uh, today I'd like to extend this series that I've been doing of videos and talk a little bit more about functional medicine and, and exactly how it works and, and how I look at uh, the practice of functional medicine. I think the best way to do that is uh, I'll provide a case that I had recently, which I think really shows how functional medicine um, is able to, to work for different patients. This particular patient uh, was a young man. He was, he's a 20 year old white male. He presented to the clinic with a recent history of uh, social anxiety and depression. He'd had that about six months. He was a college student and uh, he'd been placed on Paxil for his social anxiety. So we went through the usual things that I do. We, we did an extensive uh, history. Uh, I did some lab work on this particular young man and um, his initial lab work all looked very normal. His CBC was completely normal other than his MCV was a little elevated and his uh, 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 red blood cells were a little bit big. And uh, the rest of his lab work looked very normal. However, after getting the history from, from this particular patient, it was pretty obvious that uh, he had some serious GI issues going on. So we ordered a stool test on, on him. And when that came back, it was, it was very illuminating. Um, uh, this young man had H. pylori, he had a parasite, and he had several pathogenic uh, uh, organisms um, in his GI tract. So the first thing we did, we, we tried to treat those, but he was in, at school at the time and he didn't tolerate it very well. So we just placed him on a diet, uh, an elimination diet, you know, no gluten, no dairy. And he was able to make it through the semester and get home where we were able to treat him a little bit better at that time. Um, we uh, placed him on a what's called an elemental diet, diet which is a, uh, a pure liquid diet that uh, basically allows the GI tract to rest, and we did that for two solid weeks. Uh, the diet also um, doesn't provide any, meat, any real sustenance for the bacteria and parasite that uh, is, is in the GI tract, so often you're able to rid the body of those uh, uh, particular problems. At the end of two weeks, the diarrhea had cleared up. He was, uh, he was able to eat uh, well again, uh, so his malnutrition became much, much better uh, at that point. We had also uh, performed some genetic tests on, on this particular young man, and he had some methylation defects and uh, which caused his homocysteine levels to be elevated. And uh, we gave some methyl B12 and some methyl folate. We cleared that aspect up. We also took a uh, look at his uh, neurotransmitters as far as the enzymes involved in breaking down uh, serotonin and uh, dopamine and norepinephrine and epinephrine. And uh, he had multiple genetic defects on both of those pathways. Um, so we were able to give him some cofactors and, and things to help those enzyme systems to bring those neurotransmitters uh, back in line, as well as you know, him being able to get his nutrition back up, mainly as protein, because you have to take in tryptophan, uh, which is a precursor for serotonin, and phenylalanine, which is a precursor for dopamine. Once we were able to get those organized, get his GI tract in order, uh, this young man was able to uh, get rid of the Paxil. He no longer had social anxiety and he no longer had any um, depression. So I think that shows functional medicine and in, in how it works in that, you know, something seemingly completely unrelated. Uh, this patient came in with a mood disorder and the actual root cause of that mood disorder was actually from his uh, gastrointestinal system and he, and he had some predisposition from his genetics. So by treating the root cause, 
of his problem, we were able to get him better. So I think that's, you know, that's what we do here. Uh, we look for root causes of problems and we go after those and try to treat those. So um, come and see us, give us a call. Again, uh, like I've said before, I do a free 15 minute uh, phone interview. Give me a call, I'll talk to you and uh, we'll see if whatever medical problems or issues you have, if, uh, if I feel like you know, we can be of help to you. So give us a call and uh, thanks for uh, watching the video website uh, you know give us a call again I offer a free 15 minute uh, phone interview so you can talk to me we can discuss what issues you may have and see if uh, this might be the right fit for you so give us a call thank you